Hi, and welcome to this Thinkbox technology preview of Deadline 8.0. This video will demonstrate our new usage-based licensing system, including its configuration at a repository and slave level. Finally, we will demonstrate how you can access your online client portal for your usage-based licensing needs. Let's first review what the Thinkbox UBL system offers to users. Usage-based licensing is an alternative to permanent and temporary licenses. Instead of one license per render node, you can purchase minutes from the Thinkbox store via prepaid bundles of hours that can be distributed among as many render nodes or workstations as you like. This usage is tracked per minute, so for example, you can run Deadline on one render machine for 60 minutes, or on 30 render machines for 2 minutes. Usage-based licensing will work with both local, remote office, and cloud-based farms, and can be used exclusively or alongside permanent and temporary licenses. Usage-based minutes are only used up while the deadline slave application is actually rendering, so if it's sitting idle, minutes won't be consumed. Thinkbox will be also partnering with select vendors to host their rendering licenses as well in our store, providing you with a one-stop shop for your future render-only licensing needs. Currently, no prices are set in stone at this time, so please do check out deadlineondemand.com and store.thinkboxsoftware.com for further details. So let's go ahead and see how UBL configuration actually works inside of Deadline. In the monitor, you can select one or more slaves and configure them to check out a usage-based license. While logged in as super user, you'll be able to initially enter your company license server URL and activation code, which are unique to your company. The URL and activation code will be provided in two separate emails from Thinkbox Sales which you can enter into your configure repository options. Once the repository is globally configured, you can simply select and configure one or more deadline slaves to either use usage base or standard licensing. Alternatively, you can use Deadline's auto configuration facility to automatically assign the licensing mode to groups of slaves, say in the case of machines which might be dynamically spawned via our balancer application in a cloud stack. Note that the license field in the slave application or slave panel in monitor now shows that a slave is taking advantage of a usage based license, whilst our local render nodes continue to use permanent licenses. It's also good news for those who join the Deadline 8 beta cycle, as you will have access to an unlimited number of free Deadline 8 beta licenses via this new UBL system. In the near future, a Thinkbox customer will be able to access their client portal as being demonstrated here. With secure logon credentials, a company or multiple authorised users from the same company will be able to review their order history, view the total usage of a UBL feature such as Deadline, or search via a particular slave name and review its usage across multiple licensed features. Many more features and configuration will be available via your client portable in the future as well. Finally, I'll leave you with our details if you wish to contact us for more information on anything you have seen today, or for a completely free deadline evaluation, or to apply for access to the Deadline 8 Beta program to test this and more new features coming in the next major release of Thinkbox Software's Deadline. Thanks for watching.